Well, I left the house at um, three o'clock this morning, I think it was, and I've driven for an hour. Um, and I've come to Lady Bower, uh, more specifically to Lady Bower Wood. And it's something I've been wanting to do for a few years now, which is get up nice and early, get up into the wood for sunrise, um, and get some shots of Pied Flycatcher. I did come here last year, if you remember, um, but that was, you know, early morning to do a bit of ringing. No ringing today, it's purely my pleasure, my enjoyment of watching these Pied Flycatchers. Um, yeah, so I've got a bit of a, I think you see, I've got my hide on my back, camera gear in my bag. I've got to, I don't know, perhaps about a mile's walk now. Up there, in the background there is the wood up on the hillside. And that's where I'm heading now. So I'll see you up there. Oh, it's a bit of a climb that. It's got a little bit further to go now. Up that hill. Maybe another 200 metres or so. Whew. Oh, I know it's going to be worth it though. Even just to hear the dog chorus in a woodland like this. An ancient oak woodland up in the Peak District. It's gonna be good, it's gonna be good, come on. Let's battle on this last little bit. Ooh. at the spot where I'm going to put my hide and I was going to do a little bit of filming of me erecting the hide but the light's really starting to come in now so I need to get this hide up as quick as possible so I'll join you inside so I'm now set up in the hide simple setup today got the nick on with the 70 to 400 zoom on sunshine for a little bit later on so I may get a little bit more daylight. Both male and female keep coming into the box and feeding in the moment so and the male's just gone back in. Well, I've been here for about three hours now. Not what a morning it's been. <laughs> so busy. They must be coming into this nest box. It's about every minute with two or three caterpillars. Very, very good parents. And there's a, um, another male starting to appear as well. So the male's not only having to feed the chicks, he's having to chase off this other male as well. I can tell that there's two different males because one's got a ring on and one hasn't. Um, Why well, they're so busy? I've just looked through the back of the hide. Um, and I've actually been just been watching a red start going in and out of a natural nest. I'm just going to get out the hide for half an hour or so. Plunk myself in the sunshine and try and warm up a little bit because it's getting a little bit cold in here. And I'll see whether I can get any red start pictures. And so I've got the red start. Um, I think they're okay. It was a bit high up so I'm kind of underneath the bird but I think they're okay. Well, what a superb morning. I think it's around 11 o'clock-ish now. And I'm exhausted. Exhausted. And now I've got to pack all this gear up and carry it back down the hill. About a mile back to the car. 
But well worth it, well worth it. Uh, quarter to three the alarm went off this morning. Wow. What a morning. Five flight catches, red starts. Don't get much better than that. <sighs> right, let's get packed up, have a quick coffee, and then we'll get back down the hill and go home. <sighs> See you next time.